unequivocally, uh, the safest way to spend Christmas this year for you and for those you love is to stay within your own household and in your own home. Uh, and my strong recommendation is that this is what you should do, if at all possible. The isolation caused by being alone over Christmas will in itself cause harm to people's welfare. And we understand that some people will simply not be prepared to leave loved ones alone over the whole Christmas period, and perhaps especially on Christmas Day. I also recognise that some people will already have made plans for Christmas. Uh, and it's for those reasons that we decided across the Four Nations to give people some clear boundaries around the Christmas period, rather than seek to prohibit any interaction altogether. We don't intend to take away uh, the flexibility. That, in my view, wouldn't be fair at this stage, and it wouldn't be realistic either. And indeed, it may risk undermining rather than strengthening compliance with the overall COVID guidance. If you are intending to form a Christmas bubble, you should already be trying to reduce any unnecessary social contacts. Uh, and this year, for most people, all of what I've just run through there will be the safer choices to make, and I would encourage everybody uh, to think very carefully about that. If you haven't made plans to form a bubble yet, please don't. If you are still swithering, please decide against. And if you have made plans but think they're not really essential, perhaps think about postponing until later in the year.